love bugs. It is now the middle of the afternoon and I had finished filming a lipstick video for you guys, my top holiday red lipstick. So you guys will see that up on my channel right now. So if you haven't, I will link that video down below for you guys just in case you wanna check it out. Um, but now, uh, Sean and I are heading down to Niagara Falls. We want to go see some of the Christmas lights, right babe? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna head down to Niagara region. We're going to check out the lights and we're also going to go and have some dinner at one of our favorite spots called La Scala. And it is a mom and pop Italian restaurant, but they have some of the best food there. It's really, really good. So we stopped at Starbucks. I grabbed a latte, Sean grabbed one as well and yeah, we're just gonna venture down. And we're not doing dinner or the falls anymore because it's pouring rain. So walking outside amongst the lights by the falls already, which already make you sort of misty and damp when you walk among them anyway, is just a sloppy, messy idea. So we abandoned our second plan for Sean is sweet, I'm just feeling anxious about Oscar, so I just honestly just wanna get home to him. I feel kinda of guilty leaving him, so we're in the dollar store just to pick up a few things, and then I'm going to head back to the house. We're just gonna make some dinner, and we finally got hooks for the tree, so I'm gonna put up the remaining decorations, so I'll show you guys that, finally. And we're just gonna chill out for the night. Sean just grabbed these. They are his favorite kind of like gummy snacks, which you think would be like meh, cause it's dollar store, but actually these are pretty friggin' good. Right. Work calls. <laughs> Guys, they have a pony. I love my little ponies. They're so cute. I used to love them as a kid. Is it wrong that I still want to play with toys as an adult? <laughs> I totally would. Look how cute. I love them. Spider-Man floss. What? Spider-Man floss <laughs> What is that? Do you need diarrhea really, Sean? Would you have green apple splatters? <laughs> You need rabbit diarrhea at least. I'm this a firm user. <laughs> you are Get not. Firm user. Ah. <laughs> so what was supposed to be an eventful evening turned out to be basically nothing. We're not really doing much of anything anymore. So anyway, we're gonna make some dinner and look, we got some hangers for the decorations, finally. So I am going to put up the final decorations I showed you guys a few days ago and get those up on the tree um, now that we have these little babies. All right, so I'm in my like office closet-ish area and the hubby just put up this cute little mirror for me um, just for when I'm getting ready in the morning and so if I want to take outfit shots that I know is so lame then I have an option for that um, but because it's a little bit bare I want to put a spotlight for better lighting up there and I'm gonna put some lights down the side on either end but I am NOT someone that wants to take a lot of time or put a lot of money into like a vanity mirror I just wanted something quick so I have this little DIY project going on um, with these lights that I'm gonna put on the side of the mirror and and these are great because you can click on them and it'll turn the light on and off. So that's what I'm going to line the mirror with on either side. And the great thing is, is it came in this huge box with six of them. I have a couple of these boxes. I think I might just put three on either side of the mirror. Uh, but the awesome thing was, is I ordered these from Amazon. They were 10 bucks for a box, which is fantastic. And you just put little batteries in the back. I've already taken the backing off this. Um, but I thought it was a great little DIY hack. And then this is what I'm using for um, like the spotlight over top and this was super inexpensive as well I got all this stuff from Amazon and I will link it down below for you guys so if you want to try the same thing that's great and the best part about this is you do not need to know how to nail things into the wall if you don't want because the back of these which I'll show on one of these little doohickeys the back of these little babies actually have like a peel off tab um, that will allow you to peel it off and you can slap it on the wall and it will just stick just like so and I This is actually not my idea. I would love to steal credit for this, but I can't um, this is actually from another youtuber that had done it It looks amazing. Her name is Amber Scholl. I'll put um, a link to her videos. They're great little like DIYs and stuff 
um, down below. She's awesome. I just saw this, got inspired, and I thought, you know what? Why not? We're going to give it a go. So let's see how we do. And in case you guys are thinking I'm insane for like buying a bunch of batteries for this instead of like some better lights, I just went to the dollar store. I picked up the AAA batteries. These are $1.25 each. It's honestly absolutely nothing. I need three at a time, so I bought a couple packs to suit as many as I want. I'm going to stick them on one at a time and see how we do, but uh, yeah, not so expensive, guys. I think this whole like thing with all the lights maybe cost me, I don't know, $35, if that. And then this mirror that I've got on the wall, this was from Ikea, and I think the initial price of it was like maybe $30, something like that. Like It was really inexpensive, so good little DIY trick, guys. Okay, so excuse the mess, but I wanted to show you this little spotlight that I got. So like I said, it's really inexpensive off Amazon. And look, the little head pivots and you can turn it. Um, and it's actually like pretty bright. Like, isn't that awesome? So excited about it, guys. Um, and then like I said, it's really easy because I am not a Technica gal and just I just don't do home repairs or screws or anything like that. So you literally have this that you can just peel off the back and you can go ahead and stick that right on this little circle part right there and ta-da so you got the sort of like valkyrie side and then this was attached to it and this is the same thing it's got like a little sticky section on it and then you can slap it on that way and right onto the wall and boom babe you are ready to go okay so we're gonna start with the whoops Gonna start with the spotlight. I want it above the mirror, like just about center. And if you want to measure the mirror, you can do that. But honestly, with me, life is just not that serious. We're not gonna do that. So I'm just gonna eyeball it. And done. She's up. Good start to the project. So I have the last little disc here. I've got the sticky side available. You guys can see it's like, it's super, super sticky. Um, so I'm going to be sticking this one up on the far side. You can see I've got the other ones up on the left and the right. I just eyeballed them all because again, just couldn't be bothered to measure all that. Um, so I'm going to stick this one out. I don't know if like, you can angle these. Isn't that cool? Anyway, I'll show you later. But I'm going to stick this one on just because couldn't be bothered to measure. So I just like to make sure and bam there we are guys okay guys the diy is done there's the top light and the little ones below excuse my like scrubbies i'm in right now and the garbage on the floor um but let's turn them all on let's see how it goes bam you just get to click these whoops click all of those so obviously this is not something you like leave on all the time, but it's nice that you can just click them on to start. And bam, got yourself a cute little like outfit mirror, selfie station if you want, whatever you want to call it. But cute little DIY mirror gives some great light. And you're like all set to go, babes. Um, just because other vanity mirrors can literally run you into the hundreds and hundreds of dollars. So I thought this was a great little hack and uh, wanted to share it with you guys and obviously wanted to do it myself as well because I thought it was awesome. So yay, it's all done. And the cute little thing about these is it's got like a little dimmer. So if I click it again, it goes down a level and then off. And then these things here like actually pivot. So depending on how far in you want them or you can make them straight, whatever you want to do. I thought that was like a great little thing and then same with this one which I showed you guys before like it pivots and does all sorts of stuff you can turn it so I want it obviously pointing down at the mirror but what a fab little oops but what a fab little setup right guys like it gives the perfect amount of lighting kind of glam I love it. <laughs> That's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed coming along on my day with me. If you liked this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit the red subscribe button down below. And other than that, I love all of you, and I'll see you tomorrow. See ya.